Hi everyone. This video will run on a time limit as I'm going to demonstrate and prove how easy it is to set up a secondary class page. First, a quick revision on class pages. You can access them from your timetable on your dashboard, the side menu, or top menu, depending on how your school has set it up. Your system administrators will create your class pages for you, and it is up to you to build components onto your page, with or without a template. We will use a blank class page for our demonstration. So, start the clock at 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Ready, set, go. First things first, it wouldn't be a class page without teachers and the students. So, we can drag the class teachers and class list components from the learning tab onto our page. Next, the course we are learning about for this class. We will need the course outline component. To link our course, we need to click Import a course. Then, select the course from the list by clicking on the title. Confirm ownership by clicking Next. Select the units by checking the boxes. Add the open and close dates for each unit, and then click Next. Check the Publish, Open, Due, and Late dates for each assessment and deselect any that are not relevant. When you are happy, click Import. Links to unit pages are also a nice touch for your class page, so that unit resources and information can be accessed by students. We will add tiles to do this, and using alternative source linking, we can use pre-made tiles. It also cuts our time in half and allows me to show off a bit. You can learn more about this in the Reusing Pre-Made Content video. As collaboration is the key purpose of a class page, we will add a social stream to the page for students to ask questions and share ideas. Finally, we are just missing an appealing and motivational banner for our class page. Again, adding a tiles component will allow us greater ability to adjust the look of an image. Select Add Tile, enter a heading for the class page, adjust the colour or position of your text, then drag and drop an image from your computer. Click Save. Modify the tile layout to show one tile per row, and adjust the ratio, then click Save, and stop the timer. Wow! I beat the time. I told you it was easy. Look at what we've created in such a short time. Get on it, teachers. Remember, you can add more components as you go. These are just some basics.